I'm Deacon Danny with Christ the King School and Church. Jesus Christ is risen. Alleluia. Alleluia. Last Sunday is the second Sunday of Easter, but it's also called Divine Mercy Sunday. The Gospel reports that on the evening of the first day of the week, that is, the evening of the resurrection of Jesus, Jesus came and stood in the midst of his disciples. He said, peace be with you. Then he showed them his wounds. And he said again, peace be with you. The word most likely that Jesus said was shalom, a common greeting among Jewish people of his day. Briefly, it means much more than just peace. It also means I want for you and desire for you every good thing God wants for you. Now, that's a powerful thing to say anytime. But in the wake of the disciples' failure to remain faithful to Jesus in his most trying hours, it is good news beyond what they could have asked for or expected. Jesus is indeed God, proven especially by his resurrection and the fact that the first words he offers after the disciples' failure are words of reconciliation. Praise be to God. Then Jesus breathes on them and says, Receive the Holy Spirit, whose sins you forgive are forgiven them, and whose sins you retain are retained. Jesus gives sinners who have just experienced his compassionate and generous mercy, the power to forgive sins. Jesus gives us a sacrament of reconciliation so we too can experience his radical mercy. When's the last time you've experienced Jesus' love and mercy in the sacrament of reconciliation? If it's been over a month, Take a look at your calendar and plan to encounter the resurrected Jesus there soon. Let's pray for one another. God bless.